And welcome back to Ragecraft 3. This is now episode 34, and we have officially completed uh, pretty much half of the map, or at least half of the main quest. Uh, we're still... I guess we've completed now a, a third of the... sort of like the bonus quest, which is getting all the emeralds. Which will take, which will take quite a bit of doing. Uh, considering we're still not too sure... Uh, about that first quest we ran into back at uh, back at intersection two. So, anyways, we're gonna head back to intersection three. I actually managed to find the shortcut back to here. Had a little bit of trouble finding it because all of the buildings looked pretty similar. There wasn't a really a clear indication as to where the where the shortcut was. Here we go, and that's where the shortcut is, right past where these banners are, and the bridge. Okay, so this actually leads to four areas here. Let's first check, um, no that's not what I want, uh, okay, we, there's a book in terms of that talks about uh, which areas to go to first. All right, these are a couple of quests around here. Okay, here we go. We'll take this coal along too, why not? Okay, areas. First, Phantom Ruins, then Summoner's Lair, then Cinder Cinderblood Temple, and finally Winter's End. Okay, Phantom Ruins first. Which would be what will, I think, light gray. Yes, it is. Okay. Eight emeralds. Wow. Okay. Alright, so let's head on in. Okay, minecart. I'd rather not trust these. <laughs> Never knew what they end up running into here. Such as spiders. <laughs> Okay, let's get building blocks back on. Made a couple of buckets, as you might have already seen. So one of them I'm hoping to save for lava. Uh, is this permanent, the night vision? I kind of hope it isn't. Uh, what is this? Splash Potion of Revelation. Reveals phantoms and makes them vulnerable. Okay. Where's that zombie? Okay, there it is. Okay, these ruins belong to an ancient civilization that has long been forgotten. When the darkness reached the ruins, all of its former inhabitants returned as vengeful phantoms. Trapped between the real world and the spirit realm. These phantoms cannot be killed unless they are brought back to our dimension by these powerful potions. But careful, it can take up to three seconds for these potions to take effect once a phantom has been hit by them. Okay, so let's take a bunch of these then, yeah? Nine. Okay, that should be good. Alright, so the question is, what do they look like, these phantoms? Oh, get out of the way, zombie. Can't be bothered with you. Okay, there's a skeleton. Yeah, just normal mobs right now by the looks of it. Okay, right, I have to remember night vision. <laughs> Which is kind of helpful, but... Might as well just light up every now and then with glowstone to help light this up. Keep it safe from mobs. And natural spawns in particular. Okay, these... Okay, those guys drop potions when they die.
Ouch. Okay, there's something over here. Okay. Custom skeleton. Oh. Yeah, a couple of different custom mobs here already. That we haven't seen before. Right, there's a chest down there. Ow. Let's do some lighting up around here. Oh! Oh, hello, chicken. Must have been from a chicken jockey. What does it say? Rotten Explorer. Uh oh. Oh, the sun no longer shines. Okay. Blindness. For hopefully not too long. Ow. Stop it. <laughs> okay. Alright, so where are those rotten explorers coming from? What are you? What did it say? Okay, first emerald. So this is one of eight. Okay, I don't know what kind of potion they drop, but I'm guessing it's something poison related. I think those guys are fire resistant. Whoa, okay, hello. Alright, let's head down here. Okay, another spawner. I don't know where that creeper came from, but... Whoa! Hello. Whew. Okay, is this... No, I don't think it is a phantom. It's taking damage. Okay. Wow, I am taking a serious beating. Alright, st stop taking weather. Oh my gosh. Ouch. Jeez. It was terrible. Okay, I'm blind for a little bit longer. There we go. Where were those skeletons coming from is my question. I'm not sure that's actually going to register on my screen or not. Okay, where are they? Oh my gosh. Oh, he actually did. It looks like the invisibility invisibility wore off for this guy. So it looks like these are in fact phantoms. There we go. Okay. Yep. Okay, there we go. Alright, there's another one. Okay, there we go. Now he's revealed.
Okay, there's the other guy. There we go, now he's revealed. That's pretty neat, I gotta say. There's quite a few neat little features put into the game here. Okay, runic chest plate. Ow. Hey, where'd you come from? Protection 2, respiration 2. What was this? Protection 2, and also some knockback resistance. Might as well, I was taking quite a beating earlier. And I still have the jump boost too. Also, my health is up by heart too. Okay, there we go. What does it say? Phantom Melee. Okay, woo, okay, hello. Okay, so he's revealed now too. Okay. So that was the Rotten Explorer spawner there. And this is another chest. Tribal bow. Arrows that I don't need because I have infinity. Speaking of which. Okay, more potions of revelation. Good to know. Even though we could always just go back to the beginning. But that having one there is definitely more convenient. That was a crazy thing to do, but it worked. We're going to have to do a lot of crazy things. Here for that matter. As we already have. Okay, you know what? Stop, stop, stop. <laughs> okay. Where did that creeper go? All right, well, never mind that. Moving onward. Okay, I do want an ender pearl here. Now I've got five. I haven't used any of the any of those that I've gotten so far. Oh, I realize there's a typo on the bow. Unless that's an actual word, verdictur, verdictur. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Probably butchering the pronunciation of that. Oh, hello. Okay, normal skeleton, good. Alright, let's just go over here and just calm this area up. Calm, actually, calm, calm up. Calm up! Came up! Uh, <laughs> calm down. <laughs> Wrong direction. Okay, another rotten explore, meaning there's another spawner of them around here. Let's light up. Okay, there's another phantom. Okay, good. He was revealed. He was not. How are you still not revealed? I'm pretty sure I hit you dead on there. There we go. Thank you. Okay, I thought I saw a spawner. Whoa! Hello! Oh, no, you don't. Okay, there was a witch spawner here. What is this? Templar's Curus. Whatever the heck that is. Oh, my gosh. 
Uh oh, silverfish. Okay, that was the rotten explorer spawner. Oh, I think Fwabbit. Dang it, spider. Okay, let me fix that real quick. Ow. Oh, hello. Okay, that's where the phantom archers were coming from. And he's still not revealed. There we go. Stinking skeleton. Uh, oh. It was a bad time to get hit there. Our good thing though is that it's pretty much mostly Ooh, okay. Pretty much mostly normal mobs that are giving me trouble here. And yeah, I'm gonna leave that coal behind right now and let's do this. Yeah, just a little bit more knockback resistance and also blast protection. That should help quite a bit. Okay, there's the the melee scout, uh, melee phantoms. All right, come on. Oh. There we go. Now he's revealed. Okay, what's up here? More torches? Advanced pest control? Efficiency 5? Whoa. <laughs> uh. Okay. Okay, more splash potions of that. Oh, okay, yeah, we can't carry that many. <sighs> okay, you know, I might as well take all these torches. Oh, slime balls, you know what? This would be great for fire resistance. <laughs> what else? I guess maybe besides leads. There we go. Whoa, okay, hello. Another guy charging at me here. A couple of creepers around. Jeez. Uh, okay, let's just go around here, light up. Almost out of time for this episode, so let's... Get through as much of this as we can. Okay, is there... An oh, I think... Oh, yeah, I see the lime green... Lime wool here. Okay, there we go. That's... All I was hoping to accomplish there. I think a creeper just... By the off chance, got hit by a skeleton there. Okay. Whoa. Okay, that was the arcane strike doing its thing there. Okay. Okay, I did not remember. Did totally forgot about the whole silverfish being here. Okay, I'm pretty sure the other spawner was just taken out there. Oh, boy. Okay, that was some kind of... Potion spawner there. That was odd. Okay, I hope I didn't blow up anything important. I think that was just there for mobs to spawn. Okay. So I think right... Uh, as you might have already seen... Uh, there's going to be like a little emerald counter for this, for areas from now on. So uh, I'll try to remember that, <laughs> remember to do those. Okay, nice. 
Next checkpoint. All right, so that's a perfect stopping point for this episode. So anyways, I hope you enjoyed this episode, and I shall see you next time in episode 35 of Ragecraft 3.